but I love this world. I think it's so freaking pretty. Like, ugh, it's so pretty over here. Oh, what the? Not him being. Oh, no. Mm mm. Hey besties, it's me Lemon and I'm back with a new video on my channel and today we do have a new series which I'm so excited to start and I am starting the family dynamics challenge and I'll leave a link down below so you can know more about the challenge and all the generations to come but we are starting off with my founder sim today which you guys are looking at right now the beautiful Aspen Glover. And so for the first generation, I'm gonna read you guys a little bit more about that and then tell you guys a little bit more about Aspen as well. So the Family Dynamics Challenge is created by Pastella Pixels and Standing Simmer. And there is rules, so we begin with the single sim, which I do have. No cheats or mods to enhance the gameplay. And custom saves are allowed, which I do, I am using a custom save for this. And the career and aspiration must be completed. And just to have fun. And I am very excited because I never really do type of challenges like this for myself. So yeah. And generation one is called White Picket Fence. From the time that you strike out on your own as a young adult, you dream of cultivating long, loving, familiar relationships as rich and unique as the dishes you love to create. You marry younger than some of your friends. You raise a bundle of children and enjoy gardening, entertaining in your spare time, yet you still devote a portion of your life to your hidden dream of becoming a master chef. And so Aspen Straits are uh, going foodie and family oriented. Her aspiration is successful lineage. In her career, she does want to be a master chef. So I am going to get her started in her career a little bit, as well as go around the world and try to get some money. And for the roles, you have to complete at least five gold level dinner parties, master cooking and baking, which I do want to have her open up a restaurant as well. So that would be fun to do. Marry as a young adult and stay happily married until death do us part. Have three to four children, which I'm not good at children. <laughs> Um, maintain a garden with at least 10 unique plants, including a cow, can, a cow plant and complete at least three slash four levels of the aspiration so yeah and upon level five of the culinary career i can leave the career and open a restaurant so like i said that's what i plan on wanting to do with this lovely aspen here so to get into it i did record this already but um the game audio is way too loud like you couldn't even hear my own voice and it was kind of embarrassing so i'm deciding to record this again i did have her start out with 500 dollars, so literally all we got was the tent but she did go around the world and she got around 400 simoleons so then i got her a cooler and then just a simple um toilet <laughs> she literally has two two walls so give me one second i'm gonna have you guys meet her friend oh let me got, let me tell you guys about her. I literally totally forgot to tell you guys more about Aspen in general. So to play off of more of the whole, you know, challenge, this first challenge. So she is from Mount Corumbai and she does live in Burlington Bay now, as you guys can tell. She did live with her parents, which they're both still alive. And so she was a student living with her parents and her dad really wanted her to pursue college and to get a degree and have something for her in life. But her mom just wants the best for her and she trusts that since this is her only child, that she will do what's right for her. And Aspen really decided that college just isn't for her, you know, the parties, studying, getting a degree in engineering, which is something that she doesn't care for. That's literally what her dad wants her to do. And she just literally wants to be a chef and open up her own restaurant or bakery, like I said. And she does want to settle down and have kids and give them the life that they want. And she obviously can't do it alone. 
and she really is in love with her best friend which this is her best friend her name is viper viper emerson and they have known each other since they were kids and they've been the best friends for as long as they can know and of course they like both have their own fair share and like boy problems and like boy trouble with you know high school dating you know stuff like that they literally have always been their shoulder to cry on but they kind of got to college and they realized that you know there may be a little something going on between them there's a little tension you see like romantic history just, it's too early to tell but there could definitely be something there like there's potential of course it's pretty much it viper the only thing is is viper is still in school and she does want to finish school so it may be a little difficult so you know will viper be the one for aspen or will viper have to find someone and move on will she be able to complete her lifetime dream of settling down having kids and opening up her own bakery and yeah that's that's aspen's story so far so let's press play and the last like when i recorded i went over to viper's house with her roomies right here harley and melody they did not like her and then harley had like the nerve to like have sex with viper and i'm like um okay it was kind of embarrassing so we kind of left but i do want to go back over there and like have her tell her like about the move tell her that she you know got out of her parents house finally she decided to finally drop out as well like i want her to tell her that and i went over there the first time and it was not pretty it was not good y'all it was not good so i'll see you guys over at viper's house with her movies okay guys so we are here at their home in windenburg it is Oh my god, is she sick? Oh yeah, I forgot she has a fever. Uh, she needs to go to her checkup, but she cannot afford it. Let me just get her to... Oh my god, I forgot I have a mod, so we're like, when we have kids, um, we have to like sign them up for school and everything. And, like I can be go to like a parent-teacher counseling and all that. Oh, I have to put a clinic down. I'll do that later. But I love Brindleton Bay. I never really got to play in it because I got all the packs at once and I haven't really played in them. But I love this world. I think it's so freaking pretty. Like, ugh, it's so pretty over here. Oh, what the? Not him being. Oh, no. Mm -mm. So I did decorate this house. It's so freaking cute. I want it to seem like a college students live here and like rich college students, you know. So we have the bong, the pipe, the DVD player, uh, the TV, which ugh, love the realism there. Um, we have like a random seat with a random pillow, sofa, some books, and a. Uh, I love this beanbag chair. It's really cute. And then. Over here in the kitchen, I love the kitchen so much. Like it really just seems like college kids live here. We got like cereal and like chips, peanut butter on the counters and cups and stuff. Oh, those cups are so freaking cute. Oh, I didn't even realize. And we got the microwave, you know, like stove, some dishes, and just like a little checkboard of stuff to do. It's just, it's really cute. It's a vibe. <laughs> we have the wine bottle, Nintendo Switch, some tea. I love the door because, you know, the backpacks, shoes, and then random clutter. Um, I didn't really do much upstairs. I kind of just gave them their beds and a desk. And uh, I was going to get them a cat. That's why I got that. I just have not got around to getting them a cat. <laughs> and then we have a little long thing out here with random things to sit on with the tv bathroom yeah that is that so i'm gonna have her come in here I'm have her come up in here and be like oh hey to little viper she's sleeping but i want her to tell her what's been going on and i want her to talk to melody and him more oh he's peeing well, 
He's taking a crap. <laughs> yeah, go talk to your bestie. Be like, hey, bestie. Peppa Moy Zerxel? Exactly. <laughs> Peppa Moy Zerxel? I'm not you being <laughs> sick. Oh my god, why is she like ignore? Like, I don't know why she keeps ignoring us. Every time. Just ask if she's feeling okay. Like, ask if she's feeling okay. Discuss interests with each other. You joke about old times. Yeah, that'd be funny. Just ask her how to help. See, they're like making up now. Oh, she's uncomfortable. Yeah. She's just like, are you okay? You know, she's like feeling sick. Like, I want her to just check on Viper. She's just like, yeah, I definitely need some coffee after that move. That move was so stressful. I'm all right, Aspen. I have some things I'm doing. Uh, thanks for checking on me. Oh, yeah. And Aspen is creative, a vegetarian. She loves cats. And she's friendly oriented. And she's high maintenance. And she's just like, yeah, that car ride. My butt was hurting. She's just like, well, at least she moved out. I'm really proud of you. I know this is something you've been wanting to do. Oh, I'm glad you don't think my llama jokes are getting old. Oh my god, she is so sick. Ah. Not good. I just... I feel bad. And she is in the creative thing, so she was just asking her, like, well, you know, how's school and everything? I want her to ask for some reassurance. And she's just like, well, I know you want to open up your bakery, so let's hope you get to do that soon. Oh, I love it. I really value the time we spend together. I think it's made us closer than ever. Aww. She's like, and you're going to start that garden too? Exactly. She's just like, yeah, of course. I wonder if she can buy a... Can she buy products for her, um, see, I'm liking Viper more this episode. I, before she was, no, when I recorded this the first time, it was not good at all. And, like, I don't know why I don't have the health option on this save. My other saves I do, but it's fine. And go exchange names be like hi my name is you know they're growing closer from quality time and closer from happy memories so that's so cute i love that and that is her love interest but these people are also love interests and whoever else as well that's a nice name aspen it's nice to meet you i'm melody oh my name is aspen it's nice to meet you melody um, what's that spot? What the heck does that even mean? Is that something mean? Well, she's just playing games. Ask her if she's feeling okay. Oh. No, she does not like mischief. Dang. Okay. So, like, they're... Complain about how cold it is. You know, they're getting closer with each other, and I like that. Viper is asleep, so I think we are gonna, like, leave Viper alone, maybe. She has to go to the bathroom, so let's go talk to Harley. Smell cologne. I wanna know what he smells like. Okay. I feel like that's a flirty action. I hope it's not. And compliment his cologne, too. And then get to know. Can I remove his face mask? I guess I can't. Oh, is this cottage core? Listen to. Oh my god, it is cottage core. The cottage core station kind of crazy. I love it. it. Gives me like Phoebe Bridger vibes. Oh my god, she is so sleepy. What does he smell like? Anything from my love? Ask them to get their partner lots of attention. This is boring. Okay. 
I'm guessing he didn't like that we wanted to smell his cologne. Um, I don't know how to take his face mask off. It's kind of bothering me. I think we're gonna go. Oh, she's gonna cook? What are you gonna cook? Okay. Oh, she cannot cook. Girl, okay. I think we're gonna go home. We really just wanted to go over there and see what was up. I think she's just gonna go home get some rest and in the morning i'm going to get her the job and the culinary career and then have her go around and get some more diggables and maybe dumpster dive as well to find some stuff in the dumpster and yeah i'll see you guys in the morning when she wakes up okay guys so she did wake up because she does have to use the bathroom I am going to have her use the bathroom and then have a quick meal of just some granola and maybe have her go back to sleep and then we'll probably head over to the park to take a shower because there was a shower at the park and she is so down bad. Ugh. She is drenched in blood. The blood, it's everywhere. Ask some clothes looks like one of those victims from a horror movie. Can we buy any online? Like, is this an option? Can she buy it online? Like, the Wicked store, right? Can she go to, like, the store and buy any? Oh my god, she... Okay, I'm gonna have her go. And like she can tell me what's there maybe okay uh <laughs> girl go to the go to the wicked store please just go really quick go there yeah okay so we can buy tampons and pads and i guess she has to actually go so i'll be back with you guys when she comes back okay so she just came back i okay so she has it Let's open that and then let's unpack the box. And can she go unwrap and go use? Oh, soup. Can you please go use it? Good. So she's going to go use the pad so she can not be drenched. Okay, so she's a tampon. Okay, good. But she still needs to go take a shower, so we, oh my god, we are going to, she just ate, so let's bring that up more. She is going to go to the park, so we can go take a shower and get some diggable. So we're going to go to the one in Oasis Springs really quick, and I'll get back with you guys when she arrives. She is here at the park. Can she remove this face mask? I am so tired of my sims putting on these damn face masks. Stop. You don't need that. Go in here. Oh my god, I could have sworn there was a shower in here. Am I tripping? Oh. We're gonna just go get some diggables for now. Let's go fishing real quick. If she went... Let's go fishing and I'm gonna wait for the diggables to come up and then we'll go to the gym so she can take a bath in Lindenburg. Cause it's like the only place I know where there's like hella gems. I'm gonna go find you some diggables. What is wrong with her? Can she stop putting a sheet mask on, girl? Go fishing. She literally, okay, whatever. Since you wanna have a sheet mask on that bad, you can have it on that bad. I ain't gonna fight it no more. I'm tired of fighting it. I'm so tired of fighting it. And there's like no diggables here, okay? There's one. There's like literally none here. Oh my god. Can she just catch the fish? Please go catch a fish. Can we? Okay, so there's like a lemon tree, but there's nothing in the lemon tree. Oh my god, she is so pregnant, girl. Who is you? Nancy Landgrab. She does not look happy. And that ain't none of my business. That ain't none of my business, girl. She found a limestone. It should have a fossil inside of it. Okay. But can we find more dickables? More stuff to dig. 
Oh, while we're at it, join a career so you can freaking have a job. But yeah, there's literally nothing here. Um, maybe it's just because it's like early in the day. There's like nothing here. So as far as I know, let's go to culinary career. She's going to make $46 an hour. She start works in three days. Okay. So let's, what the heck is this? Sell that. Sell that. Do I have to open this or something? A broken fossil for 10 simoleons. We are doing amazing, Aspen. Honestly, we're just, we're doing great. We're doing great. <laughs> we're doing amazing. Can y'all hear the sarcasm in my voice? We're doing freaking great. Hopefully in the next couple of parts we can start, you know, getting with a Viper, hopefully, if she is the one. So she can get married because I barely have some weddings and I want her to have a big old wedding. So let's come up in here and go take a shower. I gotta know you don't have a membership here. It is snowing here. What the fuck? It is snowing. Okay, and she is gonna come dumpster dive over here as well. Because I do want her to dumpster dive. Did she take a shower? She didn't even take a shower. Go take a shower before they find out you don't have a membership. So please go take a shower. Is she done? Well, she's cold. Let's change it to her cold weather wear. I think she is cold. Do I have a cold weather wear for her? I do. It's so cute. So she's running a fever still? Oh my god. Can we go to the doctor? Or can we just like get any like cough medicine or anything? Because I think it's this mod that's doing it. You found in her inventory. Take this. Please take it. Please tell me that'll make you feel better. Does that make you feel better? Acne immunity. Okay, so it does make her feel better, but she's still uncomfortable, and I don't know why. Well, I'm gonna have her dumpster dive anyways. Let's go have her dumpster dive real quick, maybe. She can find some deals. Let's go dive for deals. Dive for some deals. Oh, I hope there's something in here, because this is disgusting. It's making her hygiene already go down. We gotta go back and take a shower. <laughs> she found recycled material. Oh my god. I don't want recycled material. She found $8. That's it. Oh my god. This isn't looking good. Okay, can she maybe start painting over here? Do a classic. Do a medium painting. Please make profit from this. I We need money. We need money. Dumpster dope. She feels disgusting from dumpster diving. I would too. I freaking would too. Let's hurry this up. I swear to God, there better be profit from this. There better be profit from this. We got 76 simoleons. Who are you, Paolo? Hey, Aspen, I know we don't know each other well, but I think it'd be really good. Oh my god, my game? I don't know why it's moving. I know we don't know each other that well, but I think we would be really good in the sack. I think we should skip the formalities and go for it. What? Um, no. I don't even know you, weirdo. Like, you're kind of weird, but... Please finish this. You are so slow. Like you taking way too long to do this. This better be worth money, Aspen, or I will be so mad at you. I will be so mad at you. 82 simoleons, you made $12 in profit from that. Oh my God, Aspen. I hate Aspen so bad. Go we'll take a shower. Let's just go take another shower. Okay, so I'm just gonna have her go home from here. 
um and then tomorrow i think we're probably just gonna go on like to the cafe or something with viper just to like talk a little more maybe go to her house and then go to a cafe so they can catch up so i will be back with you guys when she does wake up so we can get ready and head over there she doesn't know that we don't really like have a home and i kind of don't want her to like know or try to visit us because i know aspen she's a very high maintenance um i wouldn't want her to think that and viper is too i think so i feel like that'd be a little embarrassing so uh yeah I just want her to go to sleep. So she's gonna go to sleep and then I'll get ready. And when she wakes up, I'll be back with you guys. Oh, you guys, she just got a text from her mom. Her mom is still very supportive of her. Her mom's like, congrats on landing that sweet job. I think it's going to be great for you. Like I said, her mom literally just wants the best for her. Mom? So I did just change her into her sleep. Um, let's just grab a yogurt. Get some yogurt. And yeah, so her mom texted her. I think that was really cute. Oh, thanks. She called Viper. Oh, eat some of that yogurt. And then she is cramping. Can we buy like any menstrual products? Menstrual relief medicine. And that should help. So she did finish eating. She is pretty happy right now. She does need some fun. She did also take some medicine. Oh, she also needs to brush her teeth. Ugh. So I'm going to just have her relax for a little bit. She really wants to relax. Oh, she's going back to sleep. Okay. So yeah, I'll be back with you guys when she wakes up. Which is right now, actually. So wake up. We're going to start our day off early by going back is there a gym over here somewhere or is there maybe like a uh restaurant oh, there's an ice cream parlor they i don't want them to make ice cream though it's like okay so there's a park over here i wonder if it's a dog park or like an actual park so my game is a little laggy right now <laughs> mind that i don't know why like every time i go out in a build mode it just starts lagging and it's kind of annoying oh so she went over here and met okay there we go it's back to normal she went over here and met this girl what's her name corin knight they both think they're responsible okay and she is married and I do want her to tell a joke. There is a cat over here in this cat. Where is this cat at? I just saw this freaking cat. He's a stray cat. And it was a naked cat. And I... Oh, oh, this dog is so cute. I love cats and dogs. If you guys could not tell. They're adorable. Milton. Oh. And I do want her to adopt. Because, like, I love... I do want it to be a stray, maybe. I just love the cats and dogs in this. It's so cute. Who the heck is she talking to? Ew. Well, she is feeling flirty. I want her to come over here and brush her teeth, though, because she's, like, feeling insecure. And then there's no deals. No nothing in there. Oh, Aspen Emerson has an... Oh, my God. Oh my god, Aspen Emerson has a nice ring to it. What do you think, Aspen? Would you like to try things and see where it goes? I mean, yeah, we like you too, silly. Ugh. Ugh, that's so cute. Oh my god. Oh my god. So she's thinking about us. <gasps> oh. That's a fat ass, that's a fat, I was gonna say, that's a fat ass cat, and it is. Oh, this cat's so cute. Oh, Mr. Selfs to you, Sylvie, you are adorable. Oh my god, you got such a big tail. 
Are you adopted already? You have a collar. No. And ask this cat what's wrong. Oh. Can we offer our friendship to you? Can we adopt you? Oh my god. She does she stink? Can we pet you, darling? Can we pet you? Oh. Looks in need of pets and cuddles are in order. We will give you pets and cuddles. Come here. I want to give you a pet. No. No. Okay, well. It's okay. At least we met Sylvie. We are probably going to go somewhere. We're probably going to just go take her out somewhere real quick. I don't want to ask her out on a date, per se. I just want them to go out. Okay, travel. With Viper. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh. That is... <gasps> oh, my God. I think this is literally the prettiest dog I have ever seen in my life. Oh, my God. No. I want you as a pet. I want you as a pet. No. We're already traveling. Okay, guys. So we have made it to the place. The, oh, this is so cute. I love this safe file so much. We've made it to the cafe. Oh, my God. I am in love. We have made it. And so we're just going to go in. Um... Let's, can she take this freaking face mask off? We're gonna come in here. Let's form a group. So, you, got, you guys did see that text. It was so cute. Okay, so they're already in a group. So, can they come over here and order food for here? Can she order a cannoli? And then I think I'm gonna control her because, like... It's going to be annoying if I can't do that. So, could... Oh, wait. What? Okay. Control sim. This is the control any sim mod, if you guys don't know. So, she's also going to order food as well. Good. Ordering food. And then I want them to order a drink as well. For here. I want her to order... Oh God, these are expensive. Just order... A latte. And she can order for here. She can order a cappuccino. Yeah, sit outside. Sorry. Okay, so that's ours. So go eat that. And just come sit over here. Yes, she's already going over there. Good. So she is still sick. Poor baby. Look, well, she ate that. Oh, I saw your text, you know. And obviously, I do feel the same way as you. She's talking about the food right now. Um, let's just be a little romantic. Compliment her appearance. Reassurance. Like, are you sure, you know? Do you think things are going to be okay? Do you think my relationship will last? What is she going to say? <gasps> what? No, I don't want to hurt your feelings. What? Um, what the heck does that mean? So, like, I, like, she is, is she confused on her feelings? Like, I know they're, like, a very tense and stuff i think she's just confused oh my god oh that's so annoying i don't even want to have her flirt because that was awkward i'm gonna have her doing anyways so she stinks what is making her stink like this well she needs a well no you don't you don't need one you're fine what are they finna do? No, you guys don't need any more food. Stop. Just tell her, like, well, I'm glad we got to hang out. Um, just, just be like, I think I should go now. 
She just went through the door. You just be like, yeah. I gotta go. And she's gonna be like, okay. And I just, that was very... She dislikes pop music? Sure. That just wasn't the conversation I was expecting them to really have. And I just feel very, uh, let me stop controlling her. I just feel very bad. So I think with that, I'm probably going to wrap this episode up here. And in the next part, we'll probably be trying to focus more on making money and doing more of her career. Oh, she looking at her. She is looking at her like, why would you say that? Like, you just texted me that you want to be with me and try things out. And now you're saying you don't even know if, like, things will last? She is so heartbroken. Wow. Wow. I'm just, I'm shook myself. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, the first episode of this part. I have really fun recording this, and I'm excited to see where this goes and who Aspen ends up with. Comment down some suggestions down below on what you guys think that Aspen should do. How do you guys feel about Viper so far? I know Viper probably... She's kind of just, like, messing with her feelings, and it is not fun. But how do you guys think of her so far? She's like, you think she, that Aspen should maybe keep going with Viper, try things out another time, and maybe see if things change? Or do you think she should just nip this in the bud and move on to someone else? Tell me what you guys think down below. Thank you guys for watching, and leave a comment down below. Like I said, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you never miss when I post. Bye, besties.